Uh, you can throw out any preconceived notions you have about boxers when you meet Ilias Bashir. The 20-year-old wants to be an archaeologist, speaks fluent Mandarin, and is a Bates College junior. The Lewiston Auburn native won the New England Golden Gloves in March and is headed to Nationals in Detroit next week. Ilias Bashir has made himself into a two-time New England Golden Gloves champion. But the son of Somali immigrants admits he wasn't forthright with his mother when he first started in the sport at age 16. I thought I was just hanging out with friends, basically, until like, and, and then when I finally got to the point where I had to tell her I boxed, I never told her I was going to compete. And then it took until like she called coach, she called, she called my coach one day leading up asking if I was competing or not, and then that's when she finally figured out. The southpaw with a strong jab as a style that appeals to his coach. You know, he's a smart kid. And that's why he's a smart boxer. And smart boxers win. You know, I like the science of it and the good, you know, the good technique and, you know, not getting hit much and stuff. And, and that's what he does. While the glamour of the heavyweights draw in many fighters, Bashir was enamored with a 5 5 flyweight. My favorite fighter, like, of all time would be, not many people know him, but Ricardo Lopez. He's, but he was a fighter in the 90s, so I'd watch him through, like, YouTube. Bashir lost a questionable decision at Nationals last year. He'd love a championship to put on his resume as he moves towards his ultimate goal of being a pro. Like school, you got to build a resume in order to go farther than the pros. You can't just turn pro immediately and just go, go in the win, you know? I want to be fully prepared, and I think investing in the amateurs and getting to the highest level of the amateurs can help me get to the highest level of the pros. 